What's going on here? We don't have teacher Dora, Wendy, or Darcy today. No. Today we have a special guest from Malaysia, Jinji. Hi, Jinji. Welcome to Global Day. Hi, Jinji. My name is Vicky. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Vicky. Today, Jinji is going to talk about his country, Malaysia. Great. I'd love to learn about Malaysia. Okay. Welcome to Malaysia. Let's start with the location. Malaysia is a Southeast Asia, not very far from Taiwan. Malaysia is located in South Asia, from Taiwan, about four hours of flight from Taiwan. What about size? Is it bigger than Taiwan? Yes, Malaysia is nine times bigger than Taiwan, and there is the map. Malaysia is made out of two northeast regions, well Asia and East Asia, Malaysia. Malaysia is divided into two regions of the East and the West. The East is located in Malaysia, and has 11 states. The West is located in the East, and has two states. Interesting. Then what does the national flag look like? Here you go. Stripes, a, a crescent, and a star. Malaysia is a national flag of the East and the West. It represents Malaysia in the United States and the United States. 自新加坡独立后，现在代表的是十三个州属及联邦政府的平等关系。红色象征勇敢坚毅，白色象征纯洁高尚。星月图案代表伊斯兰教是马来西亚的联邦宗教。十四角星则象征着马来西亚十三个州属与联邦政府团结一致。Let's talk about the capital city. Vicky, do you know what the capital of Malaysia is? No. I don't know. It is Kuala Lumpur. Kuala Lumpur is also the biggest city of Malaysia. Oh, I see. Kuala Lumpur is Malaysia's largest city and the largest city. It is a very important city for the South Asian culture and has a great influence on the world. Many international conferences are also held here. So Kuala Lumpur is also known as the two main cities of the South Asian culture. And there is the landmark in Kuala Lumpur. I would like to mention Petronas Twin Towers, and they are 452 meters high, and they were the tallest buildings in the world from 1998 to 2004. The Twin Towers in 1998 were the tallest buildings in the world from 1998 to 2004. Wow, what a buildings! Yes, they really are. Well, let's move on to our traditional clothes. There are some pictures. You can see a woman in a baju kuru and a man in a baju melayu. Those clothes are unique. Yes, women also wear a tutun and the tutun is a head scarf that only reveals the face. Those clothes certify is Islam dress code that calls for Muslim women to dress modestly. Malaysia is a Christian country. Women most of the time wear a tutu and only show the face. I like the tutu. It's beautiful. Vicky and Lubo, you are the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Yes, I'm the most famous Malay singer in the world. Clip of the video. Awesome, Jin Jinzi. Are there any special festivals in your country? Of course, since Chinese migrants constitute 20% of the people in Malaysia, Chinese New Year is one of the most important festivals. Really? You also celebrate Chinese New Year? I can see that there are a lot of things in red, just like us. Yes. Another really important festival in Malaysia is the Yuyo Hari Raya. 
Ediphilia, celebrated by Muslims across the country. 我就读每年有为期约一个月的斋戒，在斋戒夜中，白天是禁止饮食的，必须在日落时分才可进食。开斋节是庆祝斋戒月的结束，家人和朋友间会以丰盛的美食相聚。不仅如此，人们还会盛邀邻居，甚至是陌生人到他们的房子里共同庆祝。这就是所谓 open house 的传统节庆习俗。Sounds interesting. But I don't think I can be a Muslim. Not eating and drinking through the daytime is really hard for me. Haha, <laughs> if so, I guess you will feel excited about what I'm going to introduce next. What's it? Local cuisine. It is not silent much. It's traditionally eaten from breakfast. Now people are ordering it any time of day. 这是马来西亚的国民美食——椰浆饭，带有斑斓叶香味的热米饭，与椰浆一起蒸煮，加上不同配菜，用椒叶把所有食材包裹起来食用，融合出绝佳美味。Wow, looks tasty. Sata is also a yummy snack in Malaysia. Oh, I've had that before. It tasted good. I like sata too. Ginger. I know famous actress Michelle Young is from Malaysia. Am I right? You are right. And Michelle Young was the Bond girl in Tomorrow Never Die and become the first Malaysian actor to have starring in Hollywood movies. 华裔女演员杨紫琼出生于马来西亚，以武打女星著称，曾在李安导演的电影《卧虎藏龙》中饰演飞檐走壁的江湖女子，也是《零零七》系列电影《明日帝国》中首位亚洲庞德女郎。I know her, and she is a great actress. Talking about the movies, I guess you both know the director, Chai Ming Liang. He was also from Malaysia. I've heard of him. 蔡明亮是一位出生于马来西亚的台湾电影导演，在国际间享有高知名度，曾在欧洲影展获得多项重要奖项。There is one of famous person I'd like to mention, a badminton player Lee Chong Wei. Oh oh, I've never heard of him. Li Chongwei is also a Malaysian person, known as the Big Bang Golfer, who lives in Beijing, London, and Australia, three times winning the Golden Ball in Beijing. Wow, now I know him. Well, this is all about Malaysia. Hope you enjoy it. Yes, it sounds like a very interesting country. I'd like to visit it someday. You are welcome to explore. I'd love to be your guide. Lobo and Vicky. Thank you, Ginger. I'll definitely visit Malaysia. Well, it's time to say goodbye to all the Lu Jiang kids. Bye. Bye. Bye.
what's going on here? All the clothes are on the floor. I was looking for my new black T-shirt. I couldn't find it. What's going on? You haven't finished your homework yet. Well, I was so tired that I fell asleep. Hello, everyone. I'm Lupo. 又到了说明英语每周一句的时间了。今天我们要学的是 What's going on? 发生什么事了？第一段剧中的小朋友说 ，What's going on here? All the clothes are on the floor. 发生什么事了？怎么地板上全是衣服？第二个小朋友回答 ，I'm looking for my new black T-shirt. I couldn't find it. 我在找新买的黑色 T-shirt， 我找不到。第二段剧中的小朋友说 ，What's going on? You haven't finished your homework yet. 发生什么事了？你竟还没有写完功课。第二个小朋友回答 ，Well, I was so tired that I fell asleep. 我累到睡着了。当你很压抑某件事情发生时，你就可以说 ，What's going on? 发生什么事了？现在就请小朋友跟我一起练习。What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? 今天的说明就到这儿结束喽，我们下次见 ，Bye。Bye.